Hello everyone and welcome back to New Tech and today we are going to compare the brand new Mi Band 4 versus the Lenfo T11 We did some videos before with the Lenfo T11 but today we have to compare it with the Xiaomi Mi Band 4 so let's go, let's go ahead and show you what he got with here and T11 as you can see it has similar shape with the uh, Xiaomi Mi Band 4 the T11 has a 0 0.96 inch single touch display it has a metal main body it has a built in 900 milliamp hour battery uh, which it lasts in, in about 10 days it's light waterproof so you're not supposed to go swim or shower with it it has blood pressure heart rate and some other options for example message reminder call reminder notification from Twitter Facebook and some other social media also it has some functions for fitness or health care for example step monitoring heart rate movement monitoring steps distance calorie pedometer and other things that we can show you later in the right we have the Mi Band 4 as you can see so if you don't know the Mi Band 4 it has a 0 0.95 inch AMOLED display full touch screen they both have sim the same uh, diameter of display the Mi Band 4 has a bigger battery 135 milliamp hour which it lasts in about 20 days so double the size of the T11 the Mi Band 4 has also the waterproof resistance up to up to 50 meters also it has an activity track for example count step distance calorie burn and health monitoring 24 hours heart rate and other function so let's go ahead and see what we got here in the T11 as we can see in the first page we have this circle or design like wallpaper how you want to call it in the top we have the time steps and the heart rate we have steps distance or kilometer calories, sports, sleep, blood pressure, heart rate, blood oxygen, messages and function. So we don't have a lot here. If we go to the function for example we can find stopwatch, find device and turn off we don't have too many options uh, let's go to the sport we can see we have run, cycle, mounting and that's all so we have three different sports not bad but not enough let's go to the Mi Band 4 as we can see we have here status, heart rate, workout weather notifications and more if we go to the workout we have outdoor run treadmill cycling walking exercise and pool swimming if we go to the more we have do not disturb alarm music stopwatch timer find device silent band display and settings in the settings we have more options brightness lock screen reboot factory reset regularly and about as you can see 
obviously the Mi Band 4 it's winning quite a bit in the winning in the option competition but we can see that the Mi Band 4 is a lot expensive than the T11 but now let's test some of the options that they have and let's see the comparison as we can see now we have here the T11 so let's go ahead to the first option here we have blood pressure and let's wait for the result here we have the first result so the T11 wasn't too slow that's pretty good but the screen is shutting, shutting down and that's makes the worst thing for the T11 now let's try to measure the blood pressure and we have the result finally one of them is working it vibrates for the final result let's go to the blood oxygen and let's see that as well As you can see the, the result is here with a little vibration it will take a moment but you have to wait let's go to the sport now the first one is running so let's go ahead and activate that a little vibration to tell you that now it's activated as you can see the seconds are going the steps and the heart rate in the same time so you can know that the sport works in the T11 and now it's time for the Mi Band 4 let's see how this does now as I said it's time for the Mi Band 4 let's go straight to the heart rate and test it As you can see the final result it's here with a little vibration to tell you that it's done so right after the heart rate we have workout because the Mi Band 4 doesn't have blood pressure or blood oxygen as the T11 but it has many more options for sport so let's go to outdoor run and we can see here it vibrates three times to tell you that it's starting you can see the minutes or seconds the distance the pace heart rate and the zone so yeah that's all for these options so now let's test the apps that they use let's see the difference in the apps and the options that they gives us 
as you can see now we have here the apps we have JU for the TV T11 and we have Mi Fit for the Mi Band 4 so let's go ahead without losing any time to the JU as you can see in the first page we have the date the day here target mode we have steps distance consume blood pressure sleep sista pause and heart rate quite a few options in the first page which is unusual for these apps let's go to the sleep we have the statistic for sleep for Friday which is today and we can see for tomorrow for yesterday and any other day that we want so we have sleep cease to pause evacuate if we go to sport we have the same thing we have every day that we want here to choose and here we have the step target we have total steps total distance heart rate short and consume if we go to data we have weekly statistic and monthly statistic as you can see we have step sleep statistic for weekly or monthly so you can choose whatever you want to see next we have the settings which is the profile page more and the customization options profile as you can see we have our profile here we have binding equipment downloading data target steps sedentary remind device alarm take photo auto heart detector message settings device time save power settings soft version firmware version firmware update and device recovery as you can see here you have a lot of work to do when you download this app because this app has too many options so this was all for the ju let's go to the mi fit app as we saw in the previous we have here all the data that we need to see for a day we have status walk run and cycle with the map we have the data for sleep heart rate and the weight we and we have in the end the gold track which we can see with the statistic or goal going up I hope so next we have friends we don't have any friends added yet to this option so let's just skip that and we have profile as we can see our name with the picture we have the connecting device in more we have set goals friends behavior tagging add account help feedback smart analyze and settings as you can see the me fit it's it has less options but i think for my preference it's more organized and i like more the me fit with the me band 4 so now we can see how the notification works as we can see we have here the Mi Band, Mi Band 4 connected if we go to to the apps alert we can see the apps that we selected if you go to manage apps you can select plenty more for me this works really good so as we can see now here the message with the sign where from where it is coming the name and the text right below that so that's really good so now we have to go and unpair it So we can see it's unpaired. Let's go to the JU settings. Let's connect.
as you can see we have a lot options here we have here in the back T11 I think is this one I have quite a few watches in my room so as we can see the time is synchronized and now we can go to message settings we have Facebook Messenger Twitter that I use so let's see how as you can see really clear we have the notification with the Facebook sign so that's pretty good so guys this was all for the Xiaomi Mi Band 4 versus the Lampo T11 if you have any question or suggestion feel free to comment down below we will try to reply to you all thank you for your support and for your time hit the like button subscribe our channel and we will see you in the next time